show. <laughs> I've, I've known Ewan McGregor for a long time. And let me just tell you this. I know he's very good looking now, but when he was younger, he was very ugly. <laughs> and he's had a lot of plastic surgery. <laughs> now, he probably doesn't want me to say this to you, but he paid for that plastic surgery by using his uh, profits from his life of crime. <laughs> so how adorable is he now? <laughs> you know, if you can't say anything good about your friends, then come sit by me. <laughs> All right, let's uh, take a look at the world of sport from the perspective of our friends across the pond. And by pond, I mean the Atlantic Ocean, which isn't a pond at all. It's actually a huge body of water. <laughs> it's time for another segment of ESPN UK, everybody. ESPN UK. Good evening. I'm Sir Cecil Wellesley Hogg. Hey! Jerk Weaves, uh, nobody scored more than me on or off the field. <laughs> Actually, Jerk, that's no longer true. Your scoring record was broken last night by our guest, Russian striker Ivan Grigorovich. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Dirk. It's honest to meet such a great player from so, <laughs> from so long ago in the past. Hey. <laughs> Now Dirk is like, like a fat pig, but now back in the century Dirk was booyah! We asked you, yes. So, Thanks. tell us how you got started in soccer, Ivan. <laughs> well, are you alright there, Ivan? Looks like you've got some kind of problem with your moustache. I've been exercising so hard, my nasal ducts are swelling. Yes. That could happen. Well, I had a hard childhood going on. <laughs> Growing up without father. We've got time for this. We've got time for it. Come on, you can do it. My mother, Svetlana, was very poor, and she had to work as a cheerleader for the Russian soccer team. <laughs> Wait a minute. Svetlana? Cheerleader? <laughs> <laughs> Was she in Mexico for the 1970 World Cup? Da, you've seen her. I've seen the photograph. Pale blue eyes, great set of babushkas. <laughs> Two little moles just outside of the forest. <laughs> I've never seen such moles. Her forest is now overgrown. You're talking about my mother. Oh. What are you hold crazy? on, hold on, hold on. His blue eyes, his curly hair, his almost pasted on moustache. <laughs> Dirk, I believe Ivan could be your son. It's impossible. Dirk Weems only likes the bouncy bouncy with the men. <laughs> That's true. Never hey. ever heard about Dirk making the orgy with all the hobos. Oh, come on! You had one hobo orgy and they never let you live it down. It was one! I was young, I was drunk, I needed the money, and I like hobos. <laughs> Dirk, this is bigger than that. What? I want you and Ivan to look into each other's eyes. Wow. Nit, Nit, yeah. I do not want to look in Dirk's eyes. To see is, he'll cast this sexy hobo spell on me and I will not be spooning with this horror in the back of any boxcar. Listen to me, Dirk, Ivan, I want you both to really look at each other. Son! <laughs> Must be an emotional moment for you, yeah. Ivan. Yeah, it's not every day you find out your dad is soccer legend Dirk Weems. Look at those tears of joy. <laughs> Ivan, I am your father. <laughs> <laughs> And I've also had my hair done. Do you like it? It looks great, doesn't it? But these are not tears of joy. These are tears of shame. Shame? What? Yes, he's a big champ. You know, my father is an obscene turd of a man with the boobs and the man boobs and the breast that smells like the zoo. <laughs> you are a bastard. Literally, actually, that's true. <laughs> You're a bastard. I will never be a man like you, you big kazoos and skiers. Right, come on. That's, that's all the time we have now. 